Hello everyone, Frog Pop here. Hope you're doing well out there. So I'm back today with a mystery box opening, but before we get to that, you can see um, some things are a little bit be different behind me. Uh, I went through a big reorganization project here in my room, got a new shelf behind me and reorganized everything. So looks really good in here. I love having all my He-Man stuff all together behind me added in Simpsons behind me here with it and all my turtles are over here onto the side now and my venom and zombies and stuff are now here on the front so during different videos I'll show different sides of my room and probably do future times where I show parts of the collection too but today is about the mystery box so uh, I've got this one here it is from Chalice Collectibles, and it is their three, um, it's, oh, excuse me, it's the All Exclusives Mystery Box. There's three pops per box, and they're all supposed to be exclusive pops, so exclusive to some retailer or something. Um, and it's $50 per box. Um, and there was a bunch of really good top hits and then a lot of other stuff not shown, of course, but some of the top hits that I really want, there's a bunch of different Freddies that would be really cool, of course, but, um, there's the blue chrome Batman, which would be amazing for my Batman collection over here. I would love to get that one. There's the glow Obi-Wan, which would be neat for my glow collection. There's the metallic original Kermit, which would be awesome. I love frogs, and so to have the original metallic Kermit would be so cool. Um, there's another Batman NFT, which I, of course, would love for my collection. And the metallic Frankenberry, too, which would be another really cool one. There was some other top hits also, but I think those were most of my favorites available in this box. So let's crack this open and see which, well, see what I get. If I get any of the top hits or what I end up with. So I'm not going to look. Okay, looks like I feel three. They're all in protectors. Nothing's in a hard stack. So I don't think that means, I think that means I didn't get a big hit. ahead and see what I got. Okay, I've got the first one here. One, two. Okay. Um, Might Guy 8 Inner Gates. Uh, I think many of you know me, but I don't know anything about anime, but generally anime pops have really cool glows, so I'm curious to check out this glow, and I'll show it at the end of this video, too. Um might be something I keep. Depends on the glow of it. If it's got a pretty cool glow. I'm guessing the orange flames down there glow. Or if it's not flames, collect, correct me in the comments below. But looks like it could be pretty cool. Alright, pop one. And pop two. This is one of the top hits. Oh my god. <laughs> wow, I'm pretty sure this was in the picture that they showed for one of the top hits. Um, actually, I know this is a really good pop. Wow. Uh, I do have the Ryuk back here. That was the only one I managed to get of this set years ago. I didn't get any of the rest, but I do have Ryuk, so... That's really cool. Get to add this with that. I'm pretty sure this is a good hit. Wow. Um, I'll definitely check the PVG at the end of this, but I'm shaking a little bit. Wow. <laughs> I'm definitely shaking. That is, wow. That's so cool. All right, there's still one more pop to go. And... Okay, the Toy Tokyo, I believe this was from this year's um, convention, or just the past San Diego Comic-Con convention, Bugs in 
uh, Fred Flintstone's outfit. So pretty cool. I didn't end up getting this and I did kind of want it. It sold out on the Funko side. I never did pick it up from Toy Tokyo. So this is actually kind of cool. It's one I'll It'll probably stay in my collection for a little while anyways, but yeah, I like that. That one's really cool. Um, I think I got a pretty good mystery box here. Um, I'll go ahead and check the values on these, and I will be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, so yeah, this is very interesting. I'm not sure... But before we get to that, I'll go over the other two pops. So Bugs here is $18. And this Mike Guy Chalice Exclusives Glow is $28. The problem comes with L. <laughs> So this was the all exclusives mystery box. And one thing I noticed, there's no exclusive sticker on this. So when I look it up, this is actually a Hot Topic exclusive. And with the Hot Topic sticker, it's $210. With the special edition sticker, it's $95. But mine doesn't have any sticker. <laughs> so I don't know. I am... Not sure. I looked on eBay and Mercari. Most on there do have either a Hot Topic or a Special Edition sticker. There are some without stickers. A lot of them are going for really cheap, but some are still going for around the Special Edition sticker price. So, um, not sure about this one. Um, it does have the 2018 production sticker on the bottom, but um, yeah, I'm going to have somebody take a look at this for me. Hopefully I can determine it is a legit pop. I just don't have the sticker. I don't know what I can do about that or not, but still pretty cool. Oh, I did look at the Chalice, um, Chalice Collectibles um, post for this and picture and this was one of the top hits on there, and it showed it just like this, L with cake with no sticker on it. So there must have been a run with no stickers, because I do see some online with no stickers. But yeah, it's not sh I'm not sure. Wish I had the Hot Topic sticker, though, on it. That would have been really cool. But still, overall, a uh, pretty cool mystery box. I just definitely got to look into this one a little bit more. But, um, yeah, let me know what you think of this mystery box. Um, it got pretty good hits overall. Um, yeah, and let me know what you think about this L with cake and the no sticker on it. Um, yeah, not too sure. But still, great hit. Very happy to have this in the collection. It's going to look great going next to Ryuk in my collection. Um, doubt I'll ever get the rest of these. But um, pretty cool to have this. Probably end up trading it at some point. But um, yeah, let me know. What was your favorite for today? Um, and have you checked out any of these Chalice Collectibles mystery boxes? I overall really like them. I get Chalice Collectibles every once in a while. I really like their all-exclusive mystery boxes. Um, yeah, so please give me a like. Um, comment what you think and what's your favorite out of this for today. And um, please give me a subscribe. I do have some more packages and more stuff on the way. So until next time, thanks everybody. Bye.